Okay, so this is the update to the bus, wheel, discount tire situation. Just to update you guys on what's going on, Discount Tire Corporate called me this morning. They want me to send over all the receipts and anything I find out. Um, so that's good news. So it sounds like they're gonna take care of it. So Jaylene and I were sitting together, putting together all the receipts over here. And then what we were doing that, we just got a call from Les Schwab and the bus is fixed. So we're going over there right now. We have an Uber showing up and we're gonna go pick the bus up and see what's going on. Okay, so we got our bus back. We got, <laughs> we got primary great wheels, ladies and gentlemen. So we got the bus back. Um, they came loose. We're talking to Discount Tire Corporate. I got to send them photos of all the stuff, and at least we're back on the road and we got wheels. So we're pretty stoked about that. We're gonna go back to the hotel, get our stuff together, but we still have one more night there. So let's do that. We just got back to the hotel. We are going to go put together all the receipts for Discount Tire and we're going to add up how much this little trip cost us right now. Mm -hmm. So we're about to find out. So Jaylena and I are a little rusty. We're uh, going downtown Bend. We still have the hotel for one more night, so got the bus back. We're gonna go downtown, maybe get some food. Mm -hmm. We skate and doing a little exercise. <laughs> got done eating what was that place called oh uh, hola. hola and it was so good probably the best taco salad i've ever had yeah it was that good from a restaurant hmm. it was good i don't know about the best i've ever had but it was good well you got like a very commonly eaten dish so we're wrapping up bus is done this is our last night in bend and then we're uh, gonna do some errands tomorrow and then we're headed back to the shop. Finally. Yeah. So we're all packed up. Leaving the hotel room. Finally. Finally. <laughs> it's Tuesday morning. And we're gonna go get in the bus. We're gonna go to Home Depot, do a couple errands around town, and then we're gonna head back over the pass, head back to the shop, start building buses. <laughs>
Okay, we're back at the shop. Look at all the beautiful buses. And yeah, trip's over. We made it back in one piece. Yeah, we're looking at the shop and like we gotta just spend a good day or two just cleaning up around here and resetting probably. So that's the plan, but that's it for the vlog. Oh, discount tire. Uh, so the update on that is it's about $1,500 worth of damage and expenses altogether. And they're willing to pay it if I sign a piece of paper that says it wasn't their fault. It's kind of weird. I have to sign a piece of paper saying that it's just a gesture of good faith, but they're not actually responsible. So that's where we're at with Discount Tire. We're gonna at least talk to a lawyer before I sign that paper, but I don't know how much time I really wanna give it. I would like to just get paid back and move on with my life. So I guess we'll see where that goes. Yeah. So we'll let you guys know. So that's the end of this vlog. We're back from Bend, finally. Finally. And we're gonna start building buses again. So thanks for hanging out and stay tuned for the next video. Peace. So we just got the bus fixed. I'm fixing the water problem over there right now, which we'll show you. Um, but we just got back to the shop and there is a wildfire, forest fire. Literally, we can see it from the shop. And Jaylena just got notified that we're supposed to evacuate. So, man. Bus Life Jesus just don't want us building buses right now. So I guess we're gonna gather all the titles of the buses, get the cats, and uh, get out of town. <laughs> hey, Lena, what you think? What do we do? I mean, I think we gotta go. <laughs> I, Mindy said, come on over, so we think we're gonna go hide out at her house for now and see what happens. Well, I mean, it was smoky when we were coming over the pass, but like, as soon as we got yeah. to the shop, it was fine. And then yeah. Jaylena and I were just, I don't know, we were pulling the water tank out to fix the water leak. Right. And uh, I looked up and saw the dang thing, like just right yeah. there. So, um, where we're at, we are at a level two with the fires, and as you guys saw, we can see them. We can see the fire. At this point, by the end of the night, it was so smoky that we couldn't, it wasn't the same view that you could see earlier. So, what our plan is, is um, it's, we're not necessarily under evacuation right now, but we're getting close. So, Isaac and I are going to pack up everything that we need just in, so that we are ready to go if we have to go. We have a place to go. We're gonna go to Mindy's. She is ready for us and we're gonna wait it out through the night, sleep with one eye open, just be prepared to leave, but we're going to just wait and hopefully we don't have to evacuate. Um, yeah, so that's where we're at for at the moment. And we're just hoping and praying that uh, it doesn't come that it doesn't come to that. So hopefully it doesn't come to that.